Hi, I'm Triton Graycheck. And I'm Lennon Wolf. We are juniors at Eureka Public School. Have you ever been driving through a town and noticed they didn't have a gas station or convenience store? Or a place to wash your car? That is the current situation in Eureka. We currently do not have a convenience store or car wash. We feel like having a convenience store in town would bring more business to the small town of Eureka. It would be an essential business to Eureka and the people passing through town. We would get more truckers to support our business due to its convenient location right off Highway 10 and 47. Our goal is to create a business idea for the town of Eureka. We already talked to a banker and figured out a loan, and he is planning to talk to ECDC for a small business loan. To see if our business is feasible, we, cre made, we created community surveys. Where we got community surveys back, we received positive feedback for our car wash and convenience store. In conclusion, we feel like our business would make a huge impact. Introduction. Today we are going to talk to you about our business idea, Shake and Bake. Shake and Bake would be a gas and convenience store located in Eureka, South Dakota. It would be the newest <coughs> and most up-to-date gas station and convenience store, the only car wash in our small town of Eureka. Our gas, our gas station would feature a NASCAR theme. Products of service. Our products or service would provide 24-hour gas and diesel fuel at competitive prices for anyone in need. We'd also provide up-to-date car wash facility, which will be open 24 hours and is, only is, and is the only one located within a 25-mile radius. Shake and Bake would supply convenient snacks to our customers as well as vehicle maintenance items such as oil and antifreeze. Shake and Bake will also have an ATM and public restroom during store hours. Marketing opportunity. Our ideal customers would be the citizens of Eureka, surrounding communities, and commuters who travel through Eureka on Highway 10 and 47, where it is easily accessible for truckers and vehicles to get what they need. Our customers would include people who are supporting a small town community business. Our customers would vary from all ages because of our wide variety of services available. We would be marketing to all lower and upper class individuals who are in need of gas, diesel, or convenience items. Cost of business. If you look at the function of business sheet that I handed out to you before the presentation, you'll see that the approximate starting cost of our business would be $470,000. If you look at our profit projection sheet, you'll see that we have projected that in three years we'll be making $111,928.97. And moving on to our break even analysis sheet, it will show that we will need to have an annual gross of $69,000. $69,229.54. Finally, our income and expense statement, which, which as you see will have our loan amount included, will show how much money we are projected to make in the net, in the net income next each year. Competition. One of our competitors would be Dakota Country Store, which only provides gas and diesel fuel. Another one of our competitors would be The Stop. The Stop was a convenience store and gas station until it closed last year and now only has gas and diesel fuel available. Management and Operation First place we would go to discuss our business idea would be ECDC asking for a small business loan. ECDC is Eureka Community Development Corporation that is involved in economic and community development. ECDC works with new and existing and expanding businesses through loans. There would be at least one employee at our gas station at all times at, during opening hours and perform all duties assigned to him or her by the owner or manager. As the owners, we will monitor employees, perform hiring procedures, and complete task evaluations, also work shifts when needed. Our biggest expense would be purchasing gas and diesel fuel for resale. We estimate that it will cost us approximately $56,000 $586.75 each month. Conclusion. In conclusion, we think Shake and Bake would be a great addition to the city of Eureka. Thank you for listening to our business idea. Are there any questions? Is there a department of, uh, highway department or county department of shop there in your town? Uh, like a... And I'm wondering, do they have their own sprayer wash system for their trucks and equipment? Oh, oh no, no, nothing no, like that. Yeah, no, nothing like that, no. So, Talladega Nights. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that's what's okay. yeah. All right. What kind of a car wash is it? Is it the... It's like this. You drive in, yeah. and then it'll, it'll get you, like... 
clamp, not kind of clamp to your vehicle, and then it'll self propel itself through. You put it in neutral and right. Yep, yep, yeah. Okay. All right. All right. You don't have one in a what mile radius? Car wash? Uh, 25 mile radius. We, we can't go two blocks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 get my six all the yeah, They keep going, yeah. keep going up. Yeah. Yeah. Um, do you have a building? No, we do not have a building. Okay. We'd start from scratch. And that is included in like the, the building or in that, the that sheet. Sheet. Yeah, the financial sheet. Yeah. Why do you suppose to stop, close the C store part? Uh, well, the building was kind of run down and it was in really bad shape and uh, they couldn't really find many people to manage it anymore and like I don't know it was really dirty the owners weren't I don't know because the owners like owned uh, Harriet's gas station and Bowdles and they kind of just focused more on them and the stop just kind of got ran down and yeah I, I think too what I saw is they had especially in their food department they had to have at least like four people high, are working at one time because they, they had so much of a variety of food that they had to do, which where here we would just have like the basics like your pizza, your chicken, and like just quick get up, get and go kind of foods yeah. like that. Good. Well, shake and bake means something different to us, you know, older oh. folks. So you gotta have chicken. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. How did you come up with that name? Well, we are kind of just. Well, uh, not thinking we, were, we wanted to do like a NASCAR theme. Like originally with like checkered floors and like yeah. cars and stuff, mm. and we thought of Talladega Nights with like shake and bake yeah. and stuff. So I, I always, it's a movie I reference, yeah. I I always yeah. like dreamed of if I had like a business of that old like checkered floor and that nice, you know, that that was all my dream. And then we both like cars, you know, we 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 like and enjoy them, so we thought that would be a good combination. Guys. This interaction at the end is just spectacular, the way that you're doing it. Try and bring more of that flavor when you're doing your presentations if you've got any to do again, because you're, you're interacting really great as we're asking Thank questions. You. Yeah. Did you consult with the bank and run all these numbers? Because your, your financials are pretty well put together. Rather complete. For, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we went to uh, First State Bank of Roscoe. We met with the banker there. And, yeah. Nice guy. And he, he said he'd help us out. And, yeah. Are you going to pursue this? I I'm planning on. Yeah. I'm trying to get Dad co to co-sign. <laughs> yeah. Are you guys but, uh, seniors? Juniors. No, we're juniors. juniors. Yep. Okay. Yep. So that's good. Well, good luck. Hope you get it off the ground. Thank, Thank you. you.